special, two-hour special called Testing Psychic Powers, Testing Psychic Powers Live. Right. And um, I was the person who had to arrange all the tests and so that. And the premise of the program, Randy Hopkins was a pilot for read the series. The premise of the program was that people, a psychic would challenge Randy. I would uh, you know, work uh, an arrangement with, this, with the challenger and devise a test we could do live on top of it. Right. If the person could pass the test, they would get $100,000. Huh. So for this first two hour, uh, what would you call it, a prima, uh, um, pre, it was a uh, introduction to the show, or I don't know what you call it. You know, I can't think of the word right now. Um, well, Okay. It's day four on Tim. We, yeah, anyway, I'm lucky we can finish but sentences. Anyway, with our, uh, the idea was that, uh, so we had five challengers. We uh -huh. had a uh, horror reader, we had a dowser, we had a uh, card reader, we had uh, uh, an astrologer. We had five different challengers. And, uh, but also on the program they had other things. They had uh, a lightning calculator to show that there are things that are astounding people do. And someone who could read, uh, tell from looking at the grooves in a, a vinyl record what the music was, and he could do it. Randy tested him and he could do it. Uh, so we also had Sylvia Brown on here. Why? I don't know why she was on here. And she uh, was there to demonstrate what she does. And so, she, we did it live, it was a live show, and she picked a man from the audience, and she gives us him in her reading, and she's wrong in everything. The guy kept saying, oh, no, no. So I thought that was great. <laughs> she was absolutely wrong in everything. Because this guy was from, us, from I think, Australia or something. He was, was a foreigner. He happened to be a mechanical engineer. She got everything wrong, and he just sat there, and then everything she asked was, said, oh, was that right? She said, no, it was absolutely wrong. Absolutely wrong, absolutely wrong. It was, it was, I, was, I, I thought it was great. What was her reaction whenever she failed him? Did she was she, very upset. She, what was her excuse? We know she had an excuse. Yeah. She doesn't read yeah, people yeah. from Austria or what was her? Yeah, she, she, she thought it was a plant or something. I'm not sure. I, I, have, to, I have the copy of the video. The video <gasps> we all have the video. Yeah, the video was... Oh, now that would be yeah. something we need to see. Yeah, so I had that video. I mean, unfortunately, I, that wasn't one of the things I brought with me. I brought a few DVDs that I've been transforming from the video. Right. I brought uh, DVD to show. So if, if I know you're going to do Sylvia Brown, I would have made a clip. We're always it. taking, yeah. we're all, Sylvia Brown's always yeah, on the now table. Now I think about it, that would have been a great thing to bring to my workshop, because this is a psychic, well known psychic. Most of the time, you never go wrong as I can This is where she went wrong completely. It's 100 percent. So now, this you said this is when she was becoming famous, or she was already famous. She, she, already, she, already, she already was famous. She didn't do the psychic, the uh, talk to the dead stuff. She picked that up. She's a copycat. You know? She picked that up and, uh, and became a trend. But she just did readings, and she charged at that time 750 dollars for a half hour reading over the phone. And this is before she changed her name to Sylvia Brown with an E? Oh, she was Sylvia Brown. Yeah. With an E on the end or no? That it, I don't remember. Because I was told that she changed her name to Sylvia Brown with an E on it so it would be easier, she could be hidden more because of her her conviction, her fraud conviction. That I don't know. So this is before she, she was... This, she would, yeah, she was a year later, I think, that she, uh, her, then became her ex-husband. She and her husband were convicted for fraud of some sort. Yeah. That's on Wikipedia. Yeah, you can see the documents. I gather, I think, I'm trying to remember now, I think it was uh, stocks. Uh, yeah. So were, she was recommending they buy these stocks and uh, this, this phony uh, company. Yeah. Okay, well, thank you so much, Roy. Roy, Roy Ray, I can't yeah. believe I said your name wrong. I had no idea. Okay, thanks, 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 thanks.